Justin Alcade, subject to Jaya Lee knocking out Mercedes Martinez. Hello, hello, Conan, Disco, and Joe. I just want to know what you guys think when Zaya Lee knocked out Mercedes Martinez out during their match. It's crazy how everything transpires, and I attached a link to the video if you haven't seen it or need to see it again. Did you see this, Conan? No. All right. I can pull it. it up, Joe. Yeah, I got it. All right. And this, this is industry-wide uh, that I continue to talk about. I don't know why these people. Bro, when, Let me guess. They don't put their hand up. Of course not. And it's, bro, but here's the thing. A lot of wrestlers do this that are that they're talented, but they're still green. Because when 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 they're selling these days, sometimes their hands are just dangling at their sides, like their hands are not involved in anything, well, like just that. like just holding no, a point. Of, like like watch how she turns around here. Watch if this. you're in the if you're in the street and you're in a fight or mm-hmm. somebody tries to hit you, you're, you're like instinctively gonna put your hand up. Watch this. This is brutal. If I knew she was gonna do this, there's no way I wouldn't be ready with my hand up and ready to bump to protect myself. If I knew this is the move that she's gonna give me. Can you play this, Joe? More damage, more pain. Whoa. What a roundhouse catch! The lights could be out into the cover. Shoulders are down, and just getting her shoulder up at two. Where's Martinez? Mercedes Martinez, completely glassy-eyed at this point. No idea where she's at. You got to think about Mei Ying, who rose up, and the yeah, referee called it. no See, this, choice. And let me tell you something too. This, this chick needs to learn how to work. More pain. Oh. 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 Roundhouse kick. The lights could be out. Into the. Curve. I mean, she's stiffing. Shoulders she's she's very out. stiff. Right. And like, okay, to, to turn off Joe. Yeah. This girl's very snug and stiff. Okay, and that's her gimmick. They're they're trying to. Okay, if you're in the ring with somebody like that, your first from watching her work is like, okay, I need to protect myself this match. Right. I mean, putting my hands up, this girl's throwing live rounds. All right? It's just like, you know, I just can't understand how these, these girls just, not even the girls, everybody's just sticking their head out there like this. It's the old school, not putting your hands up to protect yourself with the chairs. These people are just like, today, they're, they're not blocking anything. And we're getting concussions and injuries. And just, it's crazy. What did you think of that, Conan? Well, the the thing is, is not just not just um, you want to put your hand up uh, at all times because they might slip. There might be a mistiming issue. A lot of things can go wrong that are out of out of your control. You know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. that's why you always need to put your hand up just because of an accident. She would have put her hand up; it would have hit her hand, and she wouldn't have been knocked out. You know. So I think it's a generational thing, bro. Yeah. 